invited to Mazak here uh, for an open house event. Uh, and one of the uh, key aspects of that event is this machine behind us. And Tony, you're going to tell me all about it and what you've learned because it's really drawing the crowds here. What is the Neo Optiplex? Well, the Neo is not just about the Matrix these days. This is one fascinating machine, and I've learned a ton from Al. Al is a great teacher, to be fair, but I still have a lot to learn about this machine. With that being said, there are really key components about this that are extremely fascinating. So, the basics to start with, I mean, what is it for someone that's just tuned in? We are cutting with laser, and that's the basics of it. We're cutting all kind of metal, but what's really incredible about this machine, the, the part that sticks out the most to me is not only the increased power going from 32 millimeter to 50 millimeter and hard steels being able to cut right through it, is the ability for the sensors in this machine to read material and instantly adjust if there's imperfections in the material itself to go faster, slower, deeper, everything can be adjusted. The double dual monitor that you see behind us right now is actually separated so it doesn't bog down the system and it is quite literally reading it as it moves in a millisecond. And it's so fast. Watching this thing move, unbelievable the speed that it's cutting. Um, 50 mil width or depth of material on hard materials. I don't think I've heard of that on another machine. That's some chunky piece of steel, isn't it, potentially? Well, you think about it, right? We come from a machining world that we're very accustomed, very used to, where we take an end mill and we try to dive down 50 millimeter in a hard steel. How hard is that to do? And watching this machine almost make it look like butter is just, it blows my mind sometimes what technology has improved to. And every time we do a new event like we're here at Mazak right now, it just, we learn something new every time. So yes, 50 mil, that's incredible. Do, do you think that, that opens up a lot of new opportunities in potentially different industries? I do, I do. And not only that, when we talk about the 50 mil here, we're obviously talking about the capability to cut thicker, harder materials. But the flexibility of this Neo machine allows for the speed to be there as well. So if you want to go thinner and softer, you're going to zip through. When we, get the, when we look at this machine run, it's almost faster than you could you know, fathom at that point. And there's a, a variety of nozzles being housed in here as well, isn't there? So I suppose you change those in accordance with what you're trying to cut? Exactly right. And to make this understanding for people like you and I, when I think of a tool change with an end mill, imagine that with nozzles, which allows you to switch from material to material to different diameters. Again, one of those things that I didn't truly realize until I got here, and Al standing right behind us right now is such a great teacher that I was able to grasp this information quickly and then convey most of it to a global audience that we're talking to right now. I mean, the fiber technology for years has tried to be cap or, or, or to catch, uh, to get the edge quality of a CO2 machine. This is now potentially surpassing that as well. So it's not just about thick materials, it's about the quality of cut too. And I believe that's achieved by some of their beam shaping uh, control. Do you know much about that or do people need to tune in to watch the video you did with Al on that? Well, you're spot on, Paul. You really are. And I don't want to step out of place to pretend I know more about what's going on with that beam technology. It is one of those things that I will refer to Al every single time because it is one of those advanced modern day things. And we have a really great video coming from Al that's going to explain all that on this Neo. So stay tuned for that as well. Really good, fascinating technology from Mazak. Uh, great to be here in Chicago. Plenty more videos coming to the channel, not just about this technology, but the others that are on show here as well this week.